In the wild world of reptiles, appearances can be incredibly deceiving. What looks beautiful and harmless at first glance might actually be something you should admire from a safe distance. Snakes in particular are masters of disguise, blending into their environments and sometimes even mimicking each other to survive. Two snakes that are often mistaken for one another in North America are the corn snake and the coral snake. At a quick glance, their vibrant colors and similar patterns can easily confuse even experienced hikers and nature lovers. Both snakes are strikingly colorful, with bands of red, yellow, and black. But here's the catch, only one of them is truly dangerous to humans, while the other is completely harmless and even helpful. That's why knowing how to tell them apart isn't just interesting, it's a critical safety skill for anyone who spends time outdoors, whether you're hiking, camping, or just exploring your backyard. This guide will walk you through the key differences between these two fascinating reptiles so you can stay safe, make informed decisions, and develop a deeper appreciation for the wildlife around you. Corn snakes are actually a farmer's friend. They help control rodent populations, keeping barns and fields free from pests that can damage crops and spread disease. Their presence is a sign of a healthy ecosystem. Coral snakes, on the other hand, are equipped with potent venom, which they use to hunt small prey and defend themselves from threats. Their bite can be dangerous, so it's important to recognize them and give them plenty of space. Despite their differences, both snakes play vital roles in their ecosystems. They help maintain balance by controlling populations of rodents and other small animals, and they themselves are food for larger predators. When we learn to tell them apart, we not only protect ourselves, but we also help protect these important creatures. Respecting their space and understanding their role in nature is key to peaceful coexistence. Think of this as a nature detective adventure. Every time you spot a snake, you have the chance to use your observation skills and knowledge to solve the mystery of which species you're seeing. We'll look closely at their colors, patterns, and behaviors. These clues will help you quickly and confidently identify which snake is which, even from a distance. The harmless corn snake has evolved to mimic the appearance of its venomous cousin, the coral snake. This is a classic example of mimicry in nature, where looking dangerous can actually help a harmless animal avoid predators. By the end of this guide, you'll know which snake makes a wonderful gentle pet and which one is best admired from behind glass or from a safe distance in the wild. Encounters with these snakes can happen almost anywhere, on a hiking trail, in your backyard, or even while gardening. Being able to identify them quickly can make all the difference in how you respond. Being prepared means you can react calmly and correctly, avoiding panic and ensuring both your safety and the snake's well-being. Knowledge is your best tool in these situations. Think of this guide as your personal field manual for both safety and appreciation. With the right information, you can enjoy the outdoors with confidence and curiosity. We'll break down everything you need to know step by step using simple language and clear visuals so you'll never be left guessing. By the end of this journey you'll be an expert at spotting the difference between these two remarkable snakes ready to share your knowledge and keep yourself and others safe. Meet the corn snake, a non-venomous, gentle constrictor that's as fascinating as it is beautiful. These snakes are native to the southeastern United States where they thrive in forests, overgrown fields, and even abandoned buildings. Despite their sometimes intimidating appearance, corn snakes are harmless to humans and play a vital role in their ecosystems. Instead of using venom, the corn snake relies on its powerful muscles to wrap around its prey, usually small animals like mice, rats, or birds, and gently but firmly squeeze until the prey can no longer breathe. This method, called constriction, is both efficient and humane, allowing the snake to subdue its meal without unnecessary suffering. Corn snakes are known for their calm and curious personalities. They rarely show aggression, even when handled, which is why they're one of the most popular pet snakes in the world. Their docile nature makes them a favorite among both beginner and experienced reptile keepers. Their bodies are a canvas of vibrant orange or reddish-brown hues adorned with large black outline blotches that help them blend into fallen leaves and forest floors. This striking coloration not only makes them beautiful to look at but also provides camouflage from predators. Flip a corn snake over and you'll see a belly patterned like a checkerboard with alternating black and white squares. This unique pattern is one of their most recognizable features and helps distinguish them from other snakes. Adult corn snakes typically grow to be 3 to 5 feet long, 
Their bodies are slender and graceful, allowing them to move effortlessly through tight spaces, climb branches, and explore their surroundings with ease. On farms and rural properties, corn snakes are a farmer's best friend. By hunting and eating rodents, they help keep populations of pests like mice and rats under control, protecting crops and stored food from damage. If you spot a corn snake in your yard or garden, consider it a sign of a healthy, balanced ecosystem. Their presence means fewer pests and a natural form of pest control that benefits everyone. In captivity, corn snakes have been bred into a dazzling array of colors and patterns known as morphs. From snow white to deep red and even lavender, there's a corn snake to suit every reptile enthusiast's taste. They're easy to handle and rarely bite. When threatened, corn snakes prefer to flee or hide rather than defend themselves aggressively, making them safe companions for responsible owners. Their gentle temperament and straightforward care requirements make corn snakes ideal pets for families, children, and anyone interested in learning more about reptiles. As pets, corn snakes offer a safe and interactive way to observe reptile behavior up close. They can spark curiosity and teach respect for wildlife, making them excellent educational animals. So, if you ever see a corn snake in the wild, take a moment to appreciate its beauty and the important balance it brings to nature. These snakes are a reminder of how every creature has a role to play in our world. Corn snakes are quiet, unobtrusive neighbors, always on the lookout for their next meal, but never a threat to humans. Let's celebrate these gentle constrictors for the harmony they bring to our environment. Now let's meet the coral snake, the dangerous look-alike. Coral snakes are highly venomous with neurotoxic venom that can be fatal if untreated. Their bold red, yellow, and black bands encircle the entire body, a living warning sign. Unlike the corn snake's blotches, coral snakes have smooth, complete rings. They're secretive, spending most of their lives hidden underground or in leaf litter. Coral snakes are not aggressive and prefer to avoid confrontation. Most bites happen when people accidentally step on or handle them. Their venom is for hunting lizards and other snakes, not attacking humans. Coral snakes are not pets. The risk is too high, even for experts. Special anti-venom is required for bites, making them unsuitable for captivity. Respect coral snakes by leaving them alone and admiring from a safe distance. Their wildness and beauty are best appreciated in nature. If you see one, take a photo but never try to touch or handle it. Their striking colors are nature's way of saying, stay away, admire, don't approach. Let's break down the key differences between corn snakes and coral snakes, two species that are often confused due to their similar color patterns. Knowing how to tell them apart is not just interesting, it can be crucial for your safety, especially if you spend time outdoors in areas where both snakes are found. Corn snakes are non-venomous and have a distinctive appearance. Look for reddish-orange blotches that are outlined in black running down their back. One of the most reliable features is their belly which displays a bold checkerboard pattern of black and white squares. This unique belly pattern is a key identifier and sets them apart from many other snakes. Coral snakes on the other hand are venomous and have a very different color arrangement. Their bodies are encircled by bright red, yellow, and black rings. These rings are not just on the top but wrap all the way around the snake, creating a banded appearance that is hard to miss. If you see that the colored rings continue seamlessly onto the belly, you're likely looking at a coral snake. This is a crucial detail, as many harmless snakes have similar colors on their backs but not on their bellies. Examining the head can also help. Corn snakes have a head that is slightly wider than their neck, with a pointed snout. This gives their head a more triangular appearance compared to the coral snake. Coral snakes have a short, blunt head that is not much wider than their body, and they often have a black snout. Their head blends smoothly into their body, making it less distinct. Corn snakes are generally more robust and muscular, with a body built for constricting their prey. Their bodies appear thicker and more powerful, which is typical of constrictor snakes. In contrast, coral snakes are slender and have a uniform thickness from head to tail. They are built for burrowing and moving through tight spaces, so their bodies look more streamlined and less bulky. Both corn snakes and coral snakes have round pupils, so you can't rely on eye shape to tell them apart. This is a common misconception but it's not a useful identification feature for these two species. Remember, if you see blotches and a checkerboard belly, it's a corn snake. If you see rings that go all the way around the body, it's a coral snake. These patterns are your best visual clues. Head shape and body build are also helpful clues especially if you can observe the snake safely from a distance. Take note of the overall silhouette and how the head transitions into the body. 
Comparing photos or recalling memories of previous encounters can help reinforce these differences. The more you practice, the easier it becomes to identify them quickly and confidently. Always remember, never get too close to a snake just to confirm its identity. Use binoculars or zoom in with your camera if you need a closer look, and always prioritize your safety. Paying attention to these subtle details can make all the difference in having a safe and positive encounter with wildlife. Being able to identify snakes accurately helps protect both you and the animals. When in doubt, always keep your distance. It's better to be safe and admire these fascinating creatures from afar than to risk a dangerous encounter. There's a famous rhyme to help you remember, red on yellow, kill a fellow, red on black, friend of Jack. On a coral snake, red and yellow bands touch, danger. On harmless mimics like the scarlet kingsnake, red touches black. This rhyme is a quick way to assess risk from a distance. But remember, it only works for coral snakes in the United States. In other countries, color patterns may differ. Don't rely on the rhyme abroad. Use it as one tool, along with head shape and pattern clues. When in doubt, always assume a snake is venomous and keep your distance. Habitat can help you identify these snakes. Corn snakes are adaptable, found in fields, forests, barns, and even suburbs across the southeastern and central U.S. They're excellent climbers and often found where rodents are plentiful. Coral snakes prefer wooded, sandy, or marshy areas in the southeastern U.S. from North Carolina to Texas. They spend most of their time underground or hidden in leaf litter. After heavy rains, coral snakes may surface. Both species can overlap in places like Florida and Georgia, adding to the confusion. Corn snakes are most active at dawn and dusk. Coral snakes are secretive and often nocturnal. Knowing your local snakes is key to safe encounters. How a snake reacts when threatened can reveal a lot. Corn snakes rely on camouflage and will freeze or flee if disturbed. If cornered, they may vibrate their tails to mimic a rattlesnake or strike as a last resort. Their bites are harmless, more like a cat scratch. Corn snakes prefer bluffing and escaping over fighting. Coral snakes use their bright colors as a warning. They're shy and will try to hide. But if handled or pinned, they may bite and hold on to deliver venom. When agitated, a coral snake may hide its head and wave its tail, even making popping sounds to confuse predators. This display is a clear sign to back off immediately. Never handle a coral snake, its defense is no bluff. Both snakes want to avoid conflict, but only one poses real danger. Respect their signals and give them space. Observing from a distance keeps everyone safe. The golden rule, if you can't identify a snake, leave it alone. Most bites happen when people try to handle or kill snakes. Give snakes space and back away calmly. Wear boots and watch your step in snake country. Don't reach into places you can't see. If you find a snake in your yard, call a professional for safe removal. Never try to deal with a potentially venomous snake yourself. Teach children to respect and avoid all snakes. Show them photos of local species to build awareness. Knowledge replaces fear with respect and caution. By understanding snakes, we can coexist safely. Respect is the foundation of a healthy relationship with wildlife. The corn snake and coral snake teach us the value of wildlife education. Corn snakes are harmless helpers, great pets, and vital to the ecosystem. Coral snakes with their warning colors deserve respect and distance. Knowing the difference empowers you to stay safe and protect both snakes. Don't fear the outdoors, explore it with knowledge and confidence. Every animal has a role. Understanding them leads to safer, richer experiences. By learning to tell these snakes apart, you turn fear into fascination. You protect yourself, your family, and the snakes themselves. Respect every creature you meet. Knowledge is your best tool. The adventure of understanding nature is always worth taking.